Well, I mean, during the video, as you can imagine, um, you could hear a pin drop and, um, uh, you know, everybody is clearly moved by it. I mean, Owen here, we're going to speak to some of the pupils uh, that have watched the video. Owen, what's your reaction to it? How did it make you feel? It was heartbreaking to know that uh, families are all around us are feeling this experience because yeah. of people in our age group are sending horrid messages mm. and physical bullying as well to mm. people just like them for not having, I don't know, the newest technology, which is sending them over the edge. And it's not just pain on our half, it's also pain on their half, even though they are the bulliers for the problem. Absolutely. And, and Jodie, what do you hope the difference will be when other pupils up and down the country hopefully watch this video with their parents? Well, because it's real and it's so much more heartfelt than the dramatisations that you normally see in school, I think it'll have a much greater impact and even if one person changes their mind about sending an unkind message, mm. then it will have made such a difference. So you're talking more on a part of uh, a bully that might watch this video and you hope that it might actually change their perspective on whether what they're sending is actually worth it or not. Do you think they'll think about the impact a little more? Yeah, because it's a real story and it doesn't have the detachment that you get with the technology. So. Without that detachment, it will um, have more of an impact and mm. make me think. Thank you. And Charlotte, what do you think you would now do, having watched the video, um, if someone that you know is going through some cyberbullying or bullying of any form? I would definitely go and speak to the bully and I would approach him or her with kindness. And, like, because that's... If we go up to them and, like, we're mean to them, then they're, they're going to think it's the right thing to do, so you have to... Approach them with kindness. Maybe it'll be met defensively. And what about someone that's maybe going through the bullying? Um, definitely you could tell them to get it out there mm. to make sure they can get the appropriate help yeah. for what they're going through. Well, thank you very much, guys. So I've got my iPad here and I can't really think of anything that I'd rather be doing tonight than sitting down watching this video with my own children because it kind of feels like I have the responsibility and duty of their care um, in order to make sure that they're being kind. So I'm pledging, we're watching it tonight and I hope that everybody watching this will be watching it with their children too. Jeff, thank, thank you very you much indeed. Thank and thanks to the team there as well. So beautifully, elegantly, yeah. eloquently put. So thank you yeah, very much. Well in, done, guys. Indeed. So impressed with you all. So you should also point out, proud. once again, at the beginning, that wasn't the school that uh, that Felix was was bullied at. The school he moved moved on to, and uh, we're up to twenty seven thousand, I think, wow. twenty seven and a half thousand pledges so far since we launched this morning. As we said, it's not a pledge for money, it's just a pledge to watch and share that video. I don't think I've, we've ever done anything that I've been more proud of than this as a show, actually, so it's really, it's really quite something.